Hello, my name's Mandy Wagstaff. I'm here today to bring to you the new Wags Y Cone tool. This tool is used to create coloured wire cones which are perfect for finishing off all your jewellery pieces and the best part is it doesn't mark your coloured wire. I'm going to show you a few examples now of things that I've used to finish off jewellery. We have a twisted macrame bracelet, got a three st strand chip and nugget bracelet, a three strand plait, simple little memory wire bracelet, Viking knit, more macrame, another three strand chip and nook, nugget bracelet, a basic eight warp kumihimo braid, and again another kumihimo braid. And quite simply, I've just used the cones themselves to make a bracelet. Just going to show you a quick demonstration now of how easy it is to create the coloured wire cones. Here's how to make a single coloured wire cone. Take the wire while it's still attached to the reel and wrap it round the end of the wire cone. Tuck the wire underneath. This gives you a little tail and pop the tail through the anchor hole. And then start to wind the Y cone away from you and you'll see that your cone starts to develop immediately. Now you can continue to wrap around until you've reached your desired width of cone or length. If you do continue wrapping right to the bottom you will get an internal diameter of about 8.2 millimeters. I usually use a full length cone when I'm using 10mm or 12mm beads. Right, I'm going to stop about there because that's about all I need and snip the wire off the bottom. Now we need to remove this little loop here which is holding the wire onto the Y cone. Snip that off, take out the tail and then you have your completed wire cone.